All right, welcome back to Front Wars, ladies and gentlemen. Let's keep sticking with hard mode. Enemy has tank. We have to make good use of our explosive dudes to kill said tank. Okay. And we also have singular infantry soldierino. That's out of his range, right? Yeah. Wait, where's his range? Yeah, that's fine. We're going to want to try and sandwich him with the tank, basically. Okay. So this guy isn't getting out of range, so we're going to put him on a mountain. This guy isn't getting out of range, so we're just going to put him on a mountain too. This guy is going to have to fight this guy. So... This is the best bet, I think. As long as the tank doesn't attack him, I think we're happy. Should have checked actually if that was in range. Right, he's chosen to fight this guy. Alright, let's see how this goes. Not bad. We'll break even? Yeah, break even. That's good. That's fine for me, dude. Honestly, that's completely fine. So he can attack up to the forest. So I'm going to put him here. Uh, and I'm going to attack the tank here. Put him low. I'm going to bring this guy over to here. Even if the tank attacks my 10 on land like that, or his tank attacks my guy, um, I think I still win the trade-off, so it's fine. Yeah, there we go. And now I have initiative with my inventory, inventory with my infantry, uh, as well as 88%. Okay, 88%, I'll take it. There we go. And you've lost. He should have moved his tank back. Yeah, I'm surprised he didn't move his tank back on the first turn. I suppose I should have just been focused on moving there as opposed to anything else with the two rockets. Probably would have made more sense. Yeah. He's going to heal his tank up. But he ain't gonna have the time. Nice. It's about all infantry can ever do to tanks is like one or two. Finishes them off there, you know. It's good shit. Alright, three stars, boys. Back in the flow. Back in the flow. <laughs> Feeling good. Let's go. I have a tank now. Alright. Game's starting to get a little bit more interesting. There's an enemy barracks down there. So, you know, the most important thing is acquire enemy barracks, basically. I was wondering if that was going to be a good move, but it was, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's still technically the right decision. Not bad. Not bad at all. He is on the retreat. To save the uh, tank to kill the jeeps. Hey! Hmm. Finish off this dude. Attack this dude. Inventory did more to the tank than I thought it would there. I suppose it's just a base tank though, isn't it? Hmm. Bam, ba da ba bam, 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 ba da bam, 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 bam. Dick. Right. Working on occupying the base now. Oh man, he'd kill that guy, huh? How much damage did you do to him? I suppose I kill him. It's probably more valuable than the half dead jeep, I think. I don't think jeep will do too much damage to my tank though. Even if it's at lower health, it shouldn't do much. Wait, what? No, get out. Continue. Yeah, 
You know, I mentioned in the last episode that I'd always wanted to make one of these games. I think the only thing that hold me back at the moment is the AI programming. It'd be like, you know, you actually have to program things, the like actual work. Work is difficult. Alright. Let's just finish your bitch ass off. Capture this. You move over here. Blow the fuck out of them. You can move over here. How much damage? How much damage would you do to this guy? 53, that's not bad, I'll take it. Okay. I am winning now, this is good. I'm interested to see what he does with the Jeep, whether he retreats or not. Because he could go all the way around here. Like in theory, I could have gone across here to try and take him, but that would be a bad move. This is the most important point of the map. You can finish him off with that, it's fine. Uh, capture this. You need to get over here. There we go. That works well. Bow, bow, bow. Hey, bro. You are to lose now. Why didn't that guy attack him? Weird. Can I make a tank? No, I can only make a jeep. Well, jeep will do. No point in joining them. Let's use the tank first. Even if it puts the tank at lower health, we can get through them. It's just a matter of brute force now, really. Dun, dun, dun. We could actually send the tank back to heal up here if we wanted. Or we could suicide him like a man. Yeah, quite like a man, bro. Uh, I should use my inventory there. I didn't, I didn't check to see if he was in range. I just assumed he wasn't. It's a mistake. Oh, I should have built something as too. Oh well, doesn't really matter. He gonna be dead anyway. Fuck it, whatever. Join together, my my comrades. Mine in comraden. What's the time? Oh man, it is shower and get ready for work time. Oh, oh I'm sleepy. I've done like so much recording this morning. Two episodes of this, Dungeon Souls, two episodes of Steriden. I don't think I did any Nuclear Throne. That was a lot of recording. She's tiring, man. Oh, I could have fucking got that guy with my jeep, huh? I didn't realize the jeep had that much movement. That's a lot of movement. That's a large amount of movement. Oh, we scared. We little did we scared. Alright, rep boys. Oh, thank god. Alright, one more? Two more, probably. Keep going on hard. We got this. Uh, oh, we got an artillery, huh? Interesting, interesting. Yeah. Alright. We also have a barracks. Do they have a barracks? They do. Okay. Alright, actual strategy is required now. <sighs> okay. Oh, uh, wait. Hang on. What's your range? Yeah. Okay. The mountain is safe for now. Let's build a jeep so we can send them around. It's kind of a good idea, I think. Pop you down here, because it means you can still um, hit this. Yeah, that's fine. Pop you here. Just pop you here. Keep them well out of range, yeah. Oh, that couldn't attack? Fuck. I thought he was going to be able to attack. I fucked up. Now he's going to get wrecked. 
Move the soldier out of the way and he'll kill it with the artillery if you follow up by a tank. Oh man. Oh what really? That doesn't make much sense. I thought you could move this tank in and kill them. Keeping these three alive is most important though, because they're like my most valuable units right now. Just keep going with the jeeps for now, I think. Uh, I'll actually retreat you out, why not? Kind of makes sense. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. It kind of works, I think. It's alright, we can finish that guy off. He's gonna challenge. No, he's not gonna challenge. Oh, he's gonna finish. Shit. I didn't think they were both in range. That was kind of a mistake there. Hmm, actually, should have positioned that better. I don't think my artillery is in range. So... No, he's not. It's these two and these two. Yeah, that really sucks. Uh, let's do this. And this. And then let's do this. 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 And then let's make a heavy soldier. I think that makes the most sense to me. Takes our artillery here with this, uh, with these jeeps. Oh yeah, I didn't think about that. It's alright, we sacrificed them for a good cause. Yeah, I was say, that's not a fight you win, really. That was a bad move with that tank as well, I think. Fell into my trap. Boom! Yeah, wrecked. See you later, nerd boy. You have lost in this match and... Why did you not kill him? Fucking goddamn controls confuse me sometimes. Let's make some regular soldiers. I'm mad. What? No. Continue. End turn. Thank you. What? Why did the Jeep not attack? I'm so confused. It's stupid jeep. It's stupid, stupid jeep. Stupid jeep. Stupid. Stupid jeep. Um, you're out of range, aren't you? Damn. He's learning. Sacrifice a jeep for the sake of the artillery. And let's go start dealing some damage to his artillery. Jeeps are like sacrificial lambs right now, so it's fine. Get more of those guys coming in. Uh, where's this guy can shoot to? This, so this is safe. Uh, actually, he can't shoot next to it, can he? No. This is also safe. Progress. Uh, what shall I do? Oh, that's an enemy, huh? Ah, okay. Interesting. I thought it was mine just because he was on my side. <laughs> The colour disparities aren't as noticeable as they were in Advanced Wars, but I guess it's kind of hard to do that, really. Uh, we knew that was happening. We knew that was happening. Okay. 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 I forgot he still has a barracks, huh? That's interesting. So I, I still have two like pieces over him though because of these two. Good. 
Do these things still have ammo in this game? I don't think they, no, they don't have ammo in this game. Tanks had like ammo. Um, things that weren't inventory, uh, infant, inventory, infantry. Uh, like the the tank, the the rocket launcher dudes had ammo. They had like really low ammo. Artillery had ammo. That made it really interesting, actually. I remember that being really cool when they used to have ammo. Forgot about that. That's pretty sweet. Is the settings in the game been changed? Need to lower these a little bit. It's pretty loud on my end. That's really quiet now, though. Maybe they had. Maybe they've been changed and they just like reset themselves. Did what they want. Um, let's see. Just kill you with my artillery. Let's get the tank all up in there. Destroy the fuck out of you. And no. Yeah, let's do that. That's oh, that's in range. Fuck, fucked it. Oh well. Let's make regular soldiers. Yeah, that's good. That's right. The artillery um, are the key pieces on his side. If I can kill the artillery, then the rest of it's easy. Just barrage through it with the tank. That was a bad artillery move, I think. I'm pretty sure my tank can fit in between them there, and that's like exactly what I'm pretty sure he moves to here. <laughs> oh, maybe not because of this guy. If, they, if so, then this guy's a really strategic placement. Nope, he was stupid. Even if it doesn't shoot them, it's still like a victory for me. Oh, that was a bad move because this guy can hit him. Oh, what? He didn't shoot? Fuck. I hate it when he doesn't shoot, dude. I don't know if that's a bug or if that's me using the controls wrong. I think it's me using the controls wrong. Oh, that's whatever, he killed him. Let's just keep making inventory, fuck it. Uh, what's going on here? That's fine. My tanko still kills. He should have moved this guy in here. That would have been a good move. Hmm. I'm scared of this guy killing my tank though. This way, this guy has to move here to kill him, puts him in danger. This that should be out of range. Yep, there we go. Then that's fine. Oh, I forgot to move inventory. Sorry, right. I don't think we'll need them. Inventory. I keep calling them inventory. That's so annoying, man. God damn. That's so annoying. Oh, he chose bad. Why would you kill the jeep? They're so disposable, dude. Those jeeps are the most disposable shit I own. He forgot to make as well, but I did that too. So. Because I can't blame him there. No, oh, wait, yeah, move, attack this, please, thank you. That's right, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Another thing this game doesn't have, which was something that made Advance Wars really interesting, was all the um, characters in Advance Wars had like special power-ups so as you took damage and dealt damage your hero would gain abilities right so one of them had the like uh, and there was there's four different factions as well I think in in most of them um, which you would play through all separate campaigns and then they would start joining together and working together and stuff and you'd control multiple people um, but the power was really cool you had like a small power and a big power and they'd be things like um, drop airstrikes uh, repair units all like the different things they also like the actual characters in the game were um, really cool themselves. They kind of remind me of like characters out of like a, a kids' cartoon, or, like an anime or something like that. It's pretty sweet. Um, but yeah, that made the game really interesting. It added a lot of character to it, you know, like a lot. Uh, let's do this because this finishes this off, and you can come in here, finish this guy off, and you finish this guy off. And then we end our turn. Victory turn twenty-two. That should be three stars, right? I, I feel like I did that really well. Yeah, I did that really well. Nice. Thanks, game. 18 out of 18. 
Is this like the boss then or something? 18 out of 78 that is, isn't it? Oh, uh, okay. So we've got quite a way to go. What's Skirmish? Are these like... Community maps because there's a map builder, isn't there? Okay. Yeah, the game's... What's Axis? Oh, well, it's Oh, it's a separate campaign when you play on the opposite side. That's cool. Alright, anyway. Yeah, Front Wars um, seems pretty cool so far. I'm really excited. I'm liking liking playing it. The map editor is something I'll probably jump into at some point, but I'm in no rush. Um, but I'd be really interested to see how this game progresses. I hope it's like going to be still supported, because there's definitely a lot to add on to here. It's a bit rough around the edges. Um, it'd be cool to see those things kind of polished up over time. Or maybe in a sequel. Whatever. Hey, thanks for watching episode 2 of Front Wars. Stick around for more. Uh, I'll be, uh, I'll be plenty more to come, believe me.